Kelly Carton, who is on the trip this weekend, but unfortunately we only have one microphone, one headset this weekend, so we'll have to tag team it on the audio for you, but Kelly is chomping at the bit to get... Uh, Once again by Zahn, as now picked up at the side by Kane, and it's checked off of his stick. Still held in by Zahn, good work by Zahn, holding the line at the blue line and keeping the puck in. Good pressure here early by the Spirit, as it's dumped back down low. Now Kallenberger has it on his backhand, but he can't make a move, and finally flipped out of there by the Wildcats all the way down, and we'll get an icing. 11-11 to go here in the first period, and a good start for the Spirit as they had some sustained pressure going there in the Hilliard zone. And good work along the boards. Now we'll get a line change as Wyatt Shimp will step to the faceoff dot. And Buck is stolen by the Spirit, sent in front through the crease area, and nobody home. And back comes Hilliard down the Right wing side, now shot, and that one sails high over the net. Held in at the point, and as it's battle four along the far wall, Wyatt Schimple dropped down to the battle four along with Derek Live, picked up by Hilliard, as they'll look to center it in front. It's off a skate, can't get a shot off. Hooked up it down low once again and chase after it. Now centered in front, and John Brown will pick it up for the Spirit, dump it to the boards, and finally backhands it out of trouble. Now here's Gage Robb with the puck as he looks to make a move, can't get around the defense. And the puck will be picked up by Hilliard and sent back out as it's taken there by Brady Allen. He circles Brady to his own blue line. Now he'll dump it in and chases after it. Long off the boards and now they'll break it out. Will the Wildcats and back they come into the spirit zone. Now Bussin will step over and pick up a puck. He's checked to the boards, no call as he's boarded into the boards. No call whatsoever on that, and he's not happy about it. I'm not happy about it either. Now back come the Spirit, and it's dumped in by Major Carton. He's limping to the bench, so difficulties for Carton on that shift as well. As Puck in the Hilliard zone, and they'll send it up the far wall. Now reverse action, and they'll try the other side with it. Pressure on by the Spirit. I saw Major Limpin at the bench. I'm not sure what happened there, though. As again, the Spirit have good forecheck going, and now below the net, picked up by Hilliard, checked off the puck, and now they're finally able to break it out of there. Down the left wing side, they'll cut to the middle. Oh, and a big check there. Two Spirit players take the man down. Now he'll retrieve the puck and sends it back to the point, but it's well out of the reach of the defenseman all the way back down the ice as uh, he'll chase back after it. Pressure on by Gavin Lovin. He'll steal it. Gavin tries to work it in front and checked off of his stick and able to be cleared out by Hilliard. Chased down by Zahn Warner. He'll backhand it back out to center ice. 
Hillier picks it up there as he'll circle and regroup. Now headman pass, goes off the skate, and now it's just dumped in by Hillier. Back is Son Warner for the Spirit to pick it up behind his own net. Brings it up the boards, but held in. And now Zahn will work it to the boards, gets help from Wyatt Shimp. Weak backhander doesn't get out, and a shot from the point is on net. Cale Parker makes what I believe is his first save of this game, and now we'll get a face off in the spirit zone. No score here in the first period, 8-19 to go. Spirit taking on this Hillier Wildcats team from Ohio. Now off the draw, it's back to the point, and a shot is blocked by Skabinski, and now it's shipped back out by the Spear. Here they come, Skabinski down the right wing side. He's got Bracken in front. Tries to get it to him, and it's stolen away there by the Wildcats on a good back check. And now puck at the blue line is intercepted by the Wildcats. Tried to center the fans on it. Now below the net as a bouncing puck comes to the half wall and sent on net. Parker will drop down and save that one for another whistle. And this one will come up to his right this time. As we get line changes here for both teams. Major Carden back on the ice, so he's shaking off whatever was ailing him on that last shift. Now loose puck is sent towards the net, deflected away. Behind the net, wraparound effort in front, and doesn't go. Carden there battles for it, along with Bussin behind the net along with a pair of Wildcat players. Now, Brady Allen will step over to help out, and he'll wrist it out of there all the way down the ice, and this should go for icing, it does. And we'll come back for a face-off in the spirit zone. As Harden steps to the face-off dot once again, it's one back to the point. Cleanly, now dump back down low to the side of the net, and shot goes off the side of the net, and Bussin checked to the boards, and shot from a bad angle doesn't connect. Puck along the near wall, taken there by the Wildcats, and center in front, a shot, and a save. Dangerous opportunity there, a best scoring chance of the game for Hilliard, as Puck now to the point, wrist shot is gloved down by Bussin, and now work to the boards. Nicholas Lowe will battle for it there. And now gets help from Bussin as he'll tries to go cross ice with it, hits a player, and now taken by Brady Allen. He'll send it up the boards. Now picked up by Carden. He's able to get it out. Will Peters will chase it down. He's got Nicholas Lowe in front. Gets it to him. Behind him on his backhand, and a shot is deflected high. Good thought there, and it almost connected. Now back comes Hilliard down the right wing side. The head of steam and a good poke check there by Zahn Warner as we're going to have some penalties after the play as the Hilliard player crashed the net and got a stick on Cale Parker after he had frozen the puck, much to the dismay of the Spirit players. As we'll take a look at the instant replay on that one. Good head of speed down the right wing side and a whack there that uh, caught the attention of the Spirit defenseman and let him know about that. We'll see what the penalties are. Looks like the Spirit are going to be shorthanded as Zahn Warner is in the box, only player in the box. And we wait for the penalty to be posted. It is two minute minor for Zahn. Now off the draw, one by the Spirit. John Brown will ring it around the boards, held in. Now below the net, and it's picked up there by Hilliard as they'll work it on the power play. And look to center it, shot goes off the skate of John Brown. Now on the half ball, skated down low to the goal line. And so look to center in front, and they do a shot on net, and a save by Parker. On a shot from the right side. And we'll get a face off now with 136 to go in the penalty to Son Warner. Tyler Kane will take the draw. He's got Major Carden on his wing. And it's held in by Hilliard. It's a work to the point. And now down low 
and skated back out to the point. Cross-eyes pass, and now back pass. Hops over a stick, and so working below the net. Now in the near corner. Set in front, off a skate, and taken there by the Spirit as Major Carden will backhand it out with 105 to go in the penalty as we'll change things up here. And back home, the Wildcats to their own blue line. Big number 16 down the left wing side. And now behind the net looks to center it. Back to the point, and we've got a stoppage for the net off of its posts. And we're gonna face off here in the spirit zone. I guess it was the spirit who dislodged the net. 50 seconds to go in the power play for Hilliard. 5.14 to go in the first period. Still no score here in Indiana. As Houston Brackett steps to the face off dot. Now back to the point. As he'll circle shot, sails wide up the far wall, taken there by the Wildcats, skated back into the center ice area. And now back to the point, wrist shot, and a goal. Shot was back, the pass was back to the point, and a wrist shot beat Kale Parker to the stick side, and Hilliard able to convert on the power play to dent the net and stake themselves to a one nothing lead here with exactly five minutes to go in the first period. So back to even strength and a face off as the Spirit will pick it up but enter the zone offside. So we'll get a face off just outside the Hilliard zone. Wyatt Shimp on the draw with Skrabinski and Gage Rob on his wings and dumped in by Gunnar Beaver as Hilliard takes it there. Outlet is intercepted by Zahn Warner. He'll dump it up the boards. As now it's intercepted and skated back into the spirit zone, into the corner, and behind the net, he's worked by Warner. And now to the point, Puck is unable to be held in. It goes all the way down the ice. And played there by Hilliard. Now back they come, down the right wing side. Cuts to the middle and can't get a shot off, but now he centers it in front, and that one's sticked away by Parker. Warner on the puck now. He'll send it up ice, but not out. Dump back down low, and Zahn will pick it up once again. This time we'll try the right wing side with it. Now, this time we'll flip it up high out of the zone. As it's intercepted there, skated back in by Hilliard. The shot, and a save by Parker, as Hilliard has picked up the pace here recently as they lead 1-0 and had a good opportunity there to build on that lead. But Parker comes up with a solid save. He does a 1-0 score of 4 one to go here in the first period. Now off the draw, Kallenberger. And it's one back to the point, but there's no one standing there, and it comes all the way into the billiard zone. As Eric Live will send it forward, but it's intercepted. Now down the right wing side, the uh, pass through the crease. Doesn't connect, fortunately for the Spirit, and they're able to chip it out of there. Now taken by the Wildcats in their own zone. As Puck's held in by Gabe Kallenberger at the point momentarily, now dump back out. And Eric Life will dump it back in. Behind the Hilliard net. As pressure on by Kane. And Kevin Lovin, as Lovin intercepts the pass, tries to work in the front, but can't. Eric Life pitches down low, he'll keep it in. And now behind the net, Hilliard will work it up the near wall. Held in by John Brown as he'll dump it back down low. Now chased down by Tyler Kane in the far corner. Kane tries to center, but it's bouncing. He can't get a handle on it. And now a couple of Spirit players working in the corner, but it's picked up by Hilliard. They'll skate it back out to center ice. Now dumped into the Spirit zone as They'll hustle to it and get there first. John Brown works in the corner along with Kallenberger. As now the puck's up the near wall, picked up by Gavin Love and tries to go around a man. He does. Still on the puck. Oh, now it's poked off his stick and he'll have to hustle back after it as the spirit were changing. Now into the spirit zone, Will Peters will pick it up and dumps it back out. As puck is sent into the Hilliard zone. 
and loose puck just inside the blue line. Now it trickles back out. Boston will pick it up and send it back to his defensive partner, Brady Allen. Good pass off for Will Peters, and he'll tip it into the zone deep as Major Cardin's there for the spirit, but he can't get a handle on it. And the puck comes up the narrow wall. Now pinching in is Boston. Sends it towards the net. Now in front. And Cardin just unable to backhand that one in as the Spirit had a good opportunity there with the man in front. They were able to get it to him, but didn't really have a good angle to get a good shot off. And a fairly routine save there for the Hilliard netminder. 154 to go here in this first period. one nothing Spirit uh, trailing in this one. It's been a good, solidly played period. Spirit came out strong and had the better of the play early on. But recently, Hilliard has uh, picked up the pace and after scoring on that power play, have kind of taken the uh, taken the play to the spirit. So, spirit need to pick things up here. Now, loose puck at the blue line, and taken by Nicholas Lowe. Now, lost and stolen by Hilliard as they'll skate it back to the spirit blue line. Now, loose puck is still battled for as no one can gain possession at the moment. And now finally dumped into the Hilliard zone, and we got an icing with 1.15 to go in the first period. So face off back in the Spirit zone. Line change for the Spirit. As Wyatt Shemp, Matthew Skubinski, and Houston Brackett on the ice. Going with John Brown and Eric Life. Now plucked right in front of us here. It's sent to the blue line, but held in. Now Eric Life will wrist it out of there, into the neutral zone. And forwarded there by Shim into the Hilliard zone. Matthew Skubinski on the four check, and they're able to break that. Let's get it to the center ice line and dump it back in. John Brown hustling to it with a man on. And now, Taken by the Wildcats in front, and shot, and sails wide. Dangerous opportunity there, and a nice look from the corner sent in front, but the shot sailed wide. Now along the half wall, Brackett will battle for it. Sends it down the ice, so wave off icing as that puck, uh, puck was deflected. And now behind the net, Spirit have a good four check on. Matthew Skubinski there, but the defenseman able to avoid his check. Still loose behind the net, they'll ring around the boards. Now just 13 seconds to go in this first period. Puck sent into the spirit zone. John Brown's there to fight off his man and work it back to center ice. And that will just about do it for the first period as the buzzer sounds. And all in all, a solid first period of action. Spirit, again, came out strong, but uh, kind of uh, had the play taken to him later in that period by Hillier. So good competitive game we've got going here and should be a, a next, uh, next few periods should be fun to watch. I am going to turn it over to my broadcast partner, Kelly Carton, and he will take period number two for you. And uh, we'll see what we want to do for the third. Maybe we'll do rock, paper, scissors for the third period. So, <laughs> so here's Kelly, everyone. said as he passed it over uh, I'll be your announcer and play-by-play -play for the second period we're one to nothing home team which is the what is the team we're playing in? the Hilliard Wildcats where are they from mid Ohio Hilliard Wildcats that's good enough for me I think there's a well-known prison institution there if I'm not mistaken isn't that right so we've got quite a group in the booth here tonight, uh, Kurt Busson uh, as our main play-by-play -play man, of course Scott Lutzke doing all of the technical stuff and magic to make this happen for everybody, and Brad Allen running the camera left to right, and we're having to set up long ways on this rink just because of the way it's set up, and we're about to drop the puck for the second period. And Spirits take possession and get it into their end. 
Puck goes behind the net, back in the corner. Kallenberger picks it up. Kallenberger takes it around, tries to center it out to Warner. Gets across the blue line and into the spirit zone. Kale Parker playing aggressively out of the net and comes out and gets it almost to the top of the circles. And they clear it down to the other zone, back to the neutral zone, back to the defense. Kale, or Kallenberger's got it, taking it across the red line, dishes it in to Lovin and back out of the zone, out to Warner. Warner slaps it back in, but we're offsides now. We've touched up and back in. Puck gets by the defenseman, goes behind the net. Zon Warner brings it all the way around, sends it out to the hash marks, intercepted by Hilliard, and a little tip shot towards the back of the net, picked up by Spirit Player. Spirit Player sends it out to Lovin on the near side. He brings it across the blue line, just sends one to the net, tipped off of the Hilliard player. Kane picks it up in the far corner, gets pinned against the wall. Hilliard picks up possession, sends it in the neutral zone, and we've got a breakaway here. Number 37 takes it in on Kale Parker. Kale Parker tips it out of the way. Good little backhand shot by Hilliard. Kale handled easily, and Puck comes back in. Intercepted, tipped in the neutral zone, but back into the spirit zone. Taken behind the net by... Okay, picked up by Hilliard. Sends in front of the net. John Warner goes into the far corner to pick it up. Still bouncing around. Picked up by Major Card in the corner, looking for a breakout opportunity. Major takes it across the blue line to the red line. Intercepted by Hilliard off an errant pass. And still under control by Hilliard. They send it deep into the zone. Picked up by Allen. Allen sends it up in the air across the length of the ice. And no icing on that one. So Spirit caught a little flat-footed, looking for the icing call. Picked up by Hilliard in the corner. Big hit by Houston Brackett. Kept in at the blue line by, by uh, Big John Brown. Picked up behind the net by Hilliard. And sent out of the zone and down to the other end. Picked up by John Brown. John Brown's going to send it back in. He hits a shump. Shump takes a big hit from behind and held down right in front of the ref who decides that he doesn't really want to see anything or do anything. So a couple big hits happening there at the other corner now. A little bit of retribution coming in from the Springfield Spirit on the Hilliard player. So the whistle is blown at 9.33. Oh, sorry. Told by our uh, cameraman and tech guy that my shoulder's in the way. But here's the replay of the hits. And uh, a couple of Spirit players decided to take things into their own hands. And so right now we've got one in the box. Kurt, who's in the box? Shemp. Shemp is in the box, which uh, seems odd because he was the one that took the first hit from behind right up here. But uh, Spirit are going to be down by one. Going to be on a penalty kill here. Uh, looks like it's a major. And we've got uh, Matthew Skavinsky playing the role of two-minute guy in the box. A little shot on goal there. Bounced up in the air. Picked up by the short-handed spirit. Another little shot goes wide. Kale Parkerson's glove out there. Another shot from the far corner. Spirit box up for defense. Managed to get it out to the point. Houston Crackett gets out there to interrupt the shot. Shot goes bouncing to the far corner. Picked up by Hilliard. Hilliard sends it out to the blue line. Walks the puck up and down the blue line. Still holding it out in that corner, looking for the opening. Back hands it over to the right side. He walks it in, looking for a shot, and takes the shot. Kale Parker able to bounce it off his chest and out in front of him and cover it for the puck drop. It's going to be to Kale Parker's left on the dot. Don't know if Kale has a preference on which side he likes to have the drop on. It's going to be on his glove side. We're going to have Brad Allen out there as D. We're going to have Cal Bussin. Puck is one forward by the Spirit and can't quite get it out. And Kallenberger is fighting to the blue line. He gets it out. Popped back in, kept on sides. Puck's bouncing around up on the high slot. Picked up by Hilliard. And a nice little sniping shot going over Kale's shoulder, but hits the post, it goes wide. Picked up in the corner. Passed out to the point, back to the corner, and picked up. Far blue line, got an open shot here, walking it in, and stopped by the defenseman and Kale Parker down to the far end for no goal. So right now we're at 825. Got about 53 seconds left on the major penalty to Shemp. Uh, Matthew Skibinski serving that penalty, that two minute portion of that penalty. And Springfield gets a line change. Looks like we've got Major Carden at the right wing and 
Tyler Kane up at the, here we go, Major Carden's got a breakaway, he's into the zone. Oh, he accidentally kicks it, doesn't have, can't get a hold of it, tries to get it. And Major managed to put it in, sweeping in front of the net and covered by the goalie. Couple of, couple of shots there to clean up his miscue on the kick. He had the puck coming across the blue line and tried to kick it out to his stick and got a little bit too much on it, and sent it into the corner. Then uh, managed to recover it and get a few sweeping shots on goal, but the goalie fell on it. So we're going to get a shorthanded, going to get a shorthanded drop to the Hilliard goalie's left here. Major Carden takes the drop on center. Tyler Kane to his left. We've got uh, oh, and a shot off Tyler Kane sends it in quickly, kept in by number 58 for the Springfield Spirit. Sent to the center, and Hilliard picks it up, and they're going to send it out into the neutral zone. Number 37 picks it up. And number 58 for the Spirit picks it up and still Hilliard control, trying to get this Alzon runner in the corner. He picks it up, takes it behind the net. He's trying to gather it, gets a little caught behind the net, couple of bodies down there, bounces out to the point. And Major Carden pokes it around again and he's racing up and he's got it on the far left side and he tries to center it over to Tyler Kane. Tyler Kane then tries to center it back to Major, bounces off the foot, out to the point and then Hilliard manages to pick it up. Couple of really good chances on the short hand. Oh, here comes Hilliard. They're bringing it in. Gets a shot wide. Goes over Kale's shoulder. And picked up by Tyler Kane. Tyler Kane sends it deep. And it is going to be behind the Hilliard net. Picked up by the goalie and settled down. Going to get a change. Peters is still out on the ice, as is Zahn Werner. And now we're here at full strength. 1-0, 726 left in the game. Zahn Werner picks up the puck behind our own net. Harried by a Hilliard player. Pinned up, puck is caught in their feet. We got Gabe Kallenberger down there working on the net. And then Zahn Werner picks it up, sends it, and it bounces out into the neutral zone. Got Matthews Kamitzi chasing it down, putting some good pressure on it. Kept in by Gavin Lovin. Gavin Lovin tries to send it in. Bounced out by Skibby. Skibby tries to center it. No one there to catch it. We've got Gabe Kallenberg center sitting out, and Hilliard managed to send it deep into our zone. It's going to be picked up by number 58. 58. Gunner Beaver, number 58. Apologize for that. And uh, picked up, brought into the zone by Lovin. Lovin takes it and puts it top shelf over the goalie's stick, over the goalie's shoulder. And a Hilliard player so mad that he breaks his stick on the goal. Uh, say that again? Oh, nice. That is Gavin Lovin's first goal of the season this tournament. Spirit's first goal of the season, actually, if you consider uh, just the tournament that we were in earlier. We did score some goals against the MSU college team, but this is first goal in tournament play for the Spirit, and that ties it up at 637 in the second period. Brad Allen, our cameraman, is unaware of if he got that goal or not. Frankly, <laughs> we are, uh, we're, we're in preseason form here in the booth, everybody. We apologize for any technical glitches you may be experiencing at home during this broadcast. So we're getting ready for the drop out at center ice. We've got Houston Brackett on the right wing, Gabe Kallenberger at center. I'm sorry, Will Peters at center. And we've got Ro uh, Gage Robb at right wing, and he, or left wing. He sends it out around the back of the net pinned against the bar, and shot by Hilliard, goes wide. Gage Rob goes in hard, puts a body on the player in the hope, and the puck goes around the net, out into the center, and out of the zone. Gage Rob gives chase, puts a little pressure on, puck goes back into the spirit zone, picked up by the defense. They've got a little time to decide what to do, so they whiff on the puck and send it up the boards to the corner, picked up by Hilliard on the point, and a shot into Kale Parker. He smothers it with his chest and drops down to his knees to get a drop off to his left. Spirit getting a change. I see Brad, Brad Allen's kid, go, <laughs> Brady Allen going in. I see Cal Busson, Kirk Busson's kid going in. If they'll just send in Scott Maletsky's kid and my kid, and there goes Major Carden. We're, uh, we're an all booth team out there right now. Zane's not out there. He's the backup goalie for this game. Puck goes around the net into the far corner. Big hit by Cal Busson to pin it down, and Major Carden comes out of it, tries to center it, sends it out, and Tyler Kane picks it up, brings it into the zone. He's got a couple of trailers. Tyler Kane pauses, puts it out. Nick Lowe there, ready for the 
crashing the net, ready for the rebound if the goalie had let it go, but the goalie managed to corral it. Nick Lowe doing a good job of getting in there and being in position if that puck came loose. Like to see that kind of hustling, crashing the net. Puck is dropped, goes back, Hilliard picks it up, and it bounces over the defenseman and sent out, picked up by Cal Buston at the blue line, sent back in, back into the zone, getting a couple of uh, changes on the line for the Spirit. Skibby puts a little pressure on the goal, on the puck, sends around behind the net with the player. Gavin Levin going ahead and chasing him back. Oh, big stop there by Nick Lowe, keeping it in, but it does get out in the neutral zone, picked up by Hilliard, and Cal Bussin goes over and puts some pressure on the puck and a body on the player, and puck is still not quite under control, and picked up by Spirit, bouncing around in the far corner, and finally picked up by Hilliard, and they look for the pass out to the point, and it gets out to the blue line, blue line lines up, and bounced up into the net, and that'll be a whistle for a drop, probably outside the zone. No, nope, looks like it's gonna be in the zone. Don't know where it got tipped out of from. Gonna be a drop to Cale Parker's left. And quick line change for the Spirit. Puck goes out to the far point, comes in near. Hilliard player just sends it in due to pressure. Zahn Warner picks it up in the far corner. He's got a little room to skate. Zahn Warner puts his head down, keeps his feet moving, and he gets it out into the neutral zone. Loose the puck, and it picked up by Hilliard. Bounces around a little bit. They take it back into the zone. A little bit of offsides there, not picked up by anybody but the fans in the stands. People wearing stripes didn't see it. A little shot in. Bounces amongst some legs. It goes wide. Cale Parker never had a chance to look at it as it went wide. Puck goes back to the point. Another shot in for the point goes wide. Kale Parker just merely standing there because the puck's not coming to him just yet. And there's a little slap in there and now finally covered by Kale Parker and a scrum in front of the net. Kale Parker sprawling wide, going from pole to pole to get it stopped. Still a 1-1 game here, 4.04 left in the second period against the mid-Ohio Hilliard players and Springfield Spirit. A lot of the Hilliard players seem to be throwing sticks around, I've noticed. Uh, one of them broke it on their goal, and one uh, looks like it either dropped there or they threw it. Not sure what that was about. Dropped to Kale Parker's left. Puck goes down, and we are playing a little bit. Caught up there. Gabe Caliber, or sorry, Houston Bracket, managed to tip it, get it loose. Gets bounced out to the point. Hilliard sends it back in, far corner. John Brown goes in to chase it, puts some pressure on. Houston Bracket there to change it up. I'm sorry, that's Will Peters chasing it down into the near corner and then comes out to the far point, backhands it back along, and picked up by Will Peters and Houston Brackett fighting on the wall to get possession. Hilliard comes up with it, manages to turn the puck around. Here comes John Brown with the puck in the center. He brings the neutral zone across the red line, and he sends it deep, and then he chases it around the back of the net. And I'm not sure what this call is. A interference on. Hilliard, or maybe it's a slash. Scott Lutsky's deaf. Scott Lutsky's deaf in his right ear, so he wasn't able to tell what kind of call that he saw. So uh, Hilliard player goes into the box, number 19 for two minutes, <laughs> and Spirit is going to have. Uh, is this our first power play? All right, first power play. Puck goes into the corner. Hilliard tries to. Clear it and uh, bounces off Zahn Warner, but they managed to pick it up. And Hilliard's got a bit of a breakaway, shorthanded goal possibility here. Kale Parker managed to get it out to the side and stop the puck. I think that was actually two shots on goal right there. He tried. Here's the replay coming up. Uh, breakaway managed to take it at more cross. I think he tried to back it in and then it bounced out. And Kale Parker managed to stop it twice on that one. So Springfield Spirit on a power play. Puck is dropped to Kale's left, picked up by John. Brown takes it around the back. He passes it forward, and it goes long, and that is going to be icing. Uh, just a little bit too much on that pass up the wall there by John. No big deal. We're going to get a chance to do it again from the right side of Kale Parker. We've got Gavin Lovin out at wing. We've got Gabe Kallenberger at center, and Tyler Kane as our left wing. John Brown and Zahn Werner as our defenseman. Puck is dropped. Oh, not yet. Little jump the gun here. Ref's going to leave him into the dock. Puck goes towards the net. Tapped around. Back to John. 
Erzon, he backs it out and sends it out of the zone. Gabe Kallenberger takes a big hit on the wall, but gets the puck into the zone. Picked up by Hilliard, and they clear it out, and we're a little bit offsides. Collect ourselves here, and Hilliard's putting a lot of pressure on, on the power play here. Gavin Lovin brings it into the net. He gets a shot off, bounced out by the goalie, and Gavin Lovin picks it up on the far wall. Puck still loose, picked up by John Brown at the line. On the wall here, still trying to get it out. John Brown walks the line, sends it over to Zahn Werner. Zahn Werner winds up and taps it over for the almost really good pass. Another shot towards the goal by Gavin Lovin in the far corner. Behind the net is uh, Tyler Kane, brings it around in the near point, brings it out to the point to Zahn Werner. Zahn Werner walks it up the blue line, back to Kane here in the near wall. And he is going to take a shot. Gabe Kallenberger doing some really good work in the crease there, trying to make some room. Pucks out to Zahn Werner, back to Tyler Kane, and he sends it in. Not quite clear, Tyler Kane in there, over to Gavin Lovin. Gavin Lovin's looking for the shot, bounced off a of Hilliard player, goes into the thing, and uh, Springfield Spirit being very patient on their shot selection, but probably could pull the trigger a little faster, like Scott says here. All the way down, corralled by goalie Kale Parker. Zahn Werner picks it up out to the blue line, pass to the middle, picked up by Hilliard. Hilliard sends it back in. And now the penalty is over and we are even strength. And Puck's in the far wall on the neutral zone here, right at the red line, big scrum of bodies over there. And Hilliard comes up with it and they send it to the near far corner and picked up by, <laughs> best I could do. <laughs> and picked up by, looks like, Zahn Werner. Zahn Werner gallops it out of the zone and back in by Hilliard. John Brown's got some room and he takes it in, sends it deep in and follows it in and right back out. And we have a little bit of a one-on-one -on -one situation against Zahn Werner. Hilliard player hits the brakes for aggressive girl. Will Peters puts a body on, bounces right back off, puck goes up the wall. Will Peters puts another body on, tries to collect the puck. Puck goes over behind the net. Zahn Werner picks it up and sends it out to the point for Hilliard. Hilliard put a lot of good pressure on the puck. Here is Major Carden out in the open ice, brings it in neutral zone. He throws it into the far corner for a, for a line change. And Hilliard, thinking that there was a little more pressure than he probably needed, he sent it down for an icing. We got eight seconds left in the period here. We're gonna have a drop to the Hilliard goalie's right. And hopefully in eight seconds, Springfield Spirit can maybe snap a shot off here and make something happen. Why are they gonna give it to him to his left? Is it because of a shot from his left over to the right? I don't know. Anyway, we've got a uh, drop on the left here. We've got Gabe uh, Kallenberger at center. No chance for a shot, backed in. Uh, three seconds left, two, one, no chance for a shot there. And we are at the second intermission, one to one, going into the third period, Spirit versus the Mid-Ohio, what's the name of their team? Parolees, isn't that it? Oh, Hockey Club, I, 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 was, I was mistaken by their uh, stripes on their uniform, seemed penal. Um, so, good game so far? Uh, really fast paced and uh, you know I like the way the kids are responding you know they're keeping the pace up uh, there's a lot of contact I think in the second period they did a lot better job of protecting the puck rather than just hitting without looking at the puck what do you think? yeah I agree Kelly has been really kind of a uh, lot of momentum shifts we had a lot of uh, you know, times when the spirit really kind of carried the play and other times when uh, Hilliard was kind of the uh, more aggressive team out there. Um, like I said, a lot of back and forth action. Nice to see this group finally get the net right? and you know, the scoreboard and get this tied up coming in this third period. It should be a great third period. Very evenly in the last game here. Yeah, I think so too. I want to, even though we, we actually did win that period on the scoreboard, I think this period kind of took that second period with just the way they played. They settled down and, uh, and had a lot more possession, it felt like. And yeah, this should go for a really good prepared. Love that this game is an evenly matched game and we're getting some really good hockey here. Absolutely. So just about set for the third period here. And, uh, Thanks, Kelly. Works great. 
So we'll continue to do that, I would guess, for the, for the uh, weekend. And now we are set for third period action. Teams will trade ends once again. Kale Parker back right in front of us here. As the Peter, well, Peters will step to the faceoff dot to take the faceoff. Bracket and Gage Rob on his wings. Now puck along the near boards, just inside the Hilliard zone. Battle for there. As Will Peters will step in, try to push the puck forward. Now he'll gain possession, tries to work in front, and checked off of his stick. Now Houston Bracket sends it in front. Now back here, shot in front. Oh, and it's saved. That's the shot. The rebound came right to the stick of Gage Rob. Point blank in front. I thought he had an open net, but unable to bury it. And saved by the Hilliard goaltender. We'll get a face off in the Hilliard zone as this line will stay on the ice. Peters will take the draw once again. And this one is won by Hilliard. He'll skate the puck to the blue line and out. Now into the spirit zone. Skating hard after his busting. He's got a few men on. He'll chip it high off the boards. And now it gets up. Now Buster will pick it up once again. Sends it back out of the zone, but just out of the reach of Houston Bracket and dump back in as Eric Leif will pick it up from the spirit. Up to near the ball, now chipped out by Brackett. He's interfered with, and no call. As Puck all the way down the ice, Gage Rob for it. Therefore, the spirit, and he's checked off the puck. Now he takes a mitt to the head, no call there. As they'll continue to battle for it below the net. Good look work there by Gage. Now picked up by Gavin Lovin as he'll try to go to the point, but it's intercepted there. And now dumped below the net. Peters on it for the Spirit. Points one check. And can't backhand it in front. Will still battles for it behind the net. And now gets help from Lovin. Gavin picks it up in the near corner. Now back to the point and dumped back down low for Lovin, but it hops off of his stick. And the Spirit will have to back things out. Warner sends it back to his defensive partner, Gunner Beaver, and now picked up by Spirit in the neutral zone, but intercepted. Back come the Wildcats as Alexis get around a man a shot. Loose puck in front. And finally covered by Parker, made the initial save. And the rebound was loose between his pads, but he's able to find it and squeeze it for a whistle. 13-12 to go in this third period, still 1-1. As Gabe Kallenberger will take this draw. With Tyler Kane and Gavin Lovin on his wings. Puck battle four along the far wall, dump back down low as John Brown will skate over to pick it up, but it overskates it. And stolen by Hilliard, wraparound attempts, and staying strong on the post was Parker as he's able to prevent that wraparound attempt and finally smother it for a face-off. This time to his left. Kallenberger will take it. As bouncing puck is backhanded towards the net and deflected away. Still on the puck is Hilliard. As a battle for it behind the net. And now a little center in front. Dump back down low. Kallenberger will try to settle it and he'll skate it behind the net. Now up the boards and hops off the stick of Gavin Lovin, held in by Hilliard. Shot sails wide, Lovin will drop down and pick it up once again. Now drops it off for Eric Life. He's got pressure on. Sends it up the boards and still in there by Hilliard as there's a scrum in the far corner. Sent in front, been intercepted there by the spirit, Tyler Kane. Back for Lovin, he's got one man to beat and can't get around him. Bouncing puck at the blue line is sent back in on a delayed offside. Spirit right there, they'll tag up and re-enter the zone, but it's back out anyway. Now, loose puck in the neutral zone is chipped in and taken by Hilliard. And so they'll backhand it to the blue line, held in momentarily. And now they're able to skate it back out. As Major Card will pick it up there. Around one man, nice move for Major. As he'll skate in front, still working it. Now, Bussin drops down low to try to get a stick on it. Can't. Sends it back to the point, but it's nobody there. As Brady Allen will skate over to pick it up and dump it back in. No icing here as it was played near a Hilliard player. 
And now to the point held in. Allen, shot, sails wide. Moves around the boards and chip back to the point. Now Boston puts a stick on it. And that shot is sticked aside by the goaltender. Brady Allen will pick it up. Dunks it back down lower in the corner. Now here's Nicholas Lowe on it. Fights off a check and tries to send it in front, but it's deflected away. Bouncing puck in the corner now is fought for Matthew Skabinski there for the spirit. But Hilliard, Hilliard able to break it out. And it's center eye still dumping in. Busting there for the spirit. And we're going to get a call here. Roughing is the call. And it's going to be Brady Allen going to the box for the spirit. So the spirit will go to the penalty kill once again. 10.51 to go in this third period, 1-1 one, one score. Only goal of the game for Hilliard coming on the power play in the first period. So big uh, kill opportunity here for the Spirit. They'll have to kill this one off. As looks like it's going to be Gabe Kallenberger and Gavin Lovin killing this penalty along with Warner and Eric Life. Off the draw, puck taken by Hilliard as he'll work it on the top and shot from the point. Kale Parker saw it all the way, able to put a glove on it, and he'll freeze that one for another faceoff. As we take a look at the replay there. Now puck went back by Hilliard once again as he'll work it up high. And on the right wing side, the shot and the save is settled, but Unable to get a shot off as they're gonna rule that they're gonna rule that Hilliard knocked the net off. And this faceoff is gonna come outside the zone. Now they're gonna discuss things, make sure they have it right. Initial call was outside the zone. And much to the chagrin of the Hilliard parents. And now they're going to reverse it as we'll keep it inside the zone and say it was the spirit player who knocked the net off. 141 to go on the penalty. Gavin Lovin takes the draw for the spirit. And bouncing puck is behind the net now, picked up by Hilliard in the near corner. And skated up the half wall and now drop back down low. Eric Life will look to get a stick on it. Fans on the first effort, he'll try the other way with it, and stolen again by Hilliard. As they'll look to set things up again, but they'll fan on it. And Eric Life will backhand it to the blue line and finally back out. As a puck is loose in the neutral zone now, picked up by Hilliard. As they'll skate it back down the left wing side. And good defensive play there by Life. Puck's bent back to the blue line, and a shot is deflected. Right to the stick of the Hilliard player. Now pass back to the point, hits Lovin, and he's got to break the other way, mini break, and the Hilliard player able to get a stick on it. Now steals it once again, puts it in front, the shot. Oh, and how did that one not go? Good short-handed opportunity here for the Spirit, but they can't make it go. And now on the stick of Lovin once again, goes around a man, he's taken off the puck. No call. As now a shot for Major Carden. He's got a breakaway. Here comes Major and the goal. Shoots and a save by the goaltender. He tries to go stick side low. Another short handed opportunity for the Spirit. And a big check there at the blue line. A little bit late, but no call. Now, puck rung around the boards, held in. 12 seconds to go in the penalty. Pass down low is deflected behind the net. And now sent up the far boards, not out. Played back to the point. And a shot comes in, gets through, and a save by Parker. And the rebound is wristed out of there. Penalty is over, but that play with the puck was deflected, so no icing. Back to even strength. As into the zone, Skate Hilliard. Shot is blocked by Beaver. And back the other way come the Spirit. Here comes Matthew Skabinski down the left wing side. He'll backhand it towards the net. Bounced on and directed into the corner by the goaltender. Now held it at the point by Beaver. And Hilliard has it there in their own zone. Skated behind the net. No ring around the boards. And pressure on by the Spirit. Held in by John Brown. He'll dump it back down low. And now puck in the corner sent below the net. 
And they'll ring around the boards now. Held in at the point by Beaver. Sends it on net. And able to pick it up and put a glove on it was the Hilliard goaltender on a good opportunity there by Beaver as he just sends it towards the net with traffic in front. And the puck got through, but into the glove of the Hilliard goaltender. Now with 7.54 to go in the third period in a 1-1 game. Back to the point. Brady Allen dumps it back down low. Into the corner as Nicholas Lowe's there for the spirit. Now it comes in front, a shot, and Brady Allen puts it on net. And I believe we've only got a piece of that and sends it wide. Now Gage Robb battles for it in the corner along with Major Carden. Major gets in front, skates in the front, shot sails wide from a bad angle. And chip to the blue line and out. Back come Hilliard as Buston able to hustle back over. It trickles on net, but could have been worse as the player was streaking towards the net. Buston able to disrupt him just enough to let Kel Parker put a stick on it. Now battle four behind the net as Major Carden will pick it up. It goes up the boards, but intercepted there. Still battle four along the half wall. As now it's chipped to the point and dumped down low. Buston intercepts it there. He'll flick it to Nicholas Lowe, who's able to muscle it forward. And now chased down by the Spirit in the Hilliard zone. Dumped back down low. As Kallenberg will get there first, chips it to Nicholas Lowe, but he's unable to settle it. And back home, the Wildcats into the neutral zone. Now loose puck picked up by the Spirit. Skated back into the zone. It's Tyler Kane down the right wing side. He'll center in front, but it hits his skate and deflects into the corner. Now Kallenberger works it there, and he gets help from Kane, sends it in front, and deflected away. Backhanded to the blue line, not out. Held in by the Spirit for the moment, and now finally able to break it out of there, the Wildcats, as they'll gain the center ice line and dump it in. As Spirit back to pick it up. Gavin Lovin on the puck for the Spirit, as his pass is intercepted, and I was able to check a man off the puck. Shot comes and it was deflected. Good stick there by Beaver to prevent that opportunity. Dangerous for the Wildcats. Now they're dangerous once again in front. Loose puck and a rebound is chipped at. Stick to the side by Parker. Spirit can't clear it. Now finally, Kallenberger able to get it to the blue line, but still not out. And now it's rolling around the boards. It takes a crazy hop off the glass and finally dumped out by Gavin Lovin as the Spirit content to take an icing on that one. And they'll go for a line change here with 5.31 to go in the third period, still 1-1. With good action on both sides, scoring opportunities. Both goalies playing strong here. As Will Peters will step to the faceoff dot. And he's got Gage Robb and Houston Brackett on his wings. Shot coming off the face-off there. And another good save by Parker. We'll take a look at the instant replay there. Right off the draw, skated in front. And again, Parker able to pick that one up. Now once again, they'll get it. Oh, the player falls down at the blue line. And just unable to capitalize for the spirit as the defenseman had fallen down at the blue line. Now intercepted by John Brown. He'll skate it down the right, the left blue side. Into the zone. And battle for it just inside the blue line. Now he'll dump it down low. Will Peters chases it down from the Spirit. And gets help from Gage Robb. He's checked off the puck. And the puck will be flipped high out of the zone. Eric Life back for the Spirit. He'll back it in and send it to the blue line, but not out. Intercepting the shot, sails wide. And now to the blue line, dump it back towards the net. And picked up there by the Spirit, and they'll dump it out. Another big check on the boards. Nothing called other than icing as we get another face off in the spirit zone. 4.38 to go in this one. Getting into the latter stages of this contest as Major Cardin will step to the face off dot. Major able to pick it up and skid the puck forward to the blue line. And now finally out as Major will dump it towards the Hilliard blue line. 
Uh, so battle for it in the neutral zone. As now Hillier clearing pass to, hits a skate into the near corner. Now set in front, oh, and a shot sails just wide as Hillier will pick it up there in their own zone. Back they come, center ice, down the left wing side. And checked off the puck, loose puck bouncing, picked up by Matthew Skabinski. He's got a lane down the left wing side, he'll dump it in as the Spirit will go for a line change. And puck going around the near boards. As outlet pass is sent to center ice now, back home Hilliard, down the right wing side. Shot, sails wide, and picked up by Spirit. Backhanded out by Lovin, just outside the zone, as Hilliard will have to regroup and tag up. Now Zahn Warner has the puck with room escape. Zahn into the zone, around the left wing side, dumps it down low. And battle four in the far corner. It's picked up by Hilliard. Overskated though, and the spirit there, loose puck. It's Tyler Kane, he'll dump it behind the net. And they'll try the other side with it. Outlet pass is almost intercepted. But back come Hilliard, they've got numbers if they hurry, two on one. Set in front, oh, and a good back check there by Kallenberger as he's just able to get a stick on it, disrupt that on a dangerous opportunity there. Now puck sent back to the point, point. Uh, doesn't connect and the Spirit break it out the other way. Now uh, back to the neutral zone. And picked up by Hilliard, back they come into the center of the zone and cleared out of danger by the Spirit. Now flip to the blue line but not out. Dumped back down low by Hilliard as Gunnar Beaver will bring it around the boards, take the Spirit late in the shift here, tired as wisely Cale Parker will put a glove on it and slow things down here with 2.23 to go in the third period. Still 1-1 score. And this game is still very much in doubt. I'm not sure what the uh, rules are for any kind of overtime. I'm sure we'll probably just have a tie here in this round robin, uh, this round robin pool play. Now off the draw. Loose puck taken by Hilliard. Shot is is deflected away, and now a loose puck is saved by Parker. Back hit it out, and John Brown tries to chase it down. He'll pick it up into the zone. He sends it over for Houston Brackett, shot, and a save on a beautiful pass from Brown to Brackett. He's able to get a puck on goal. And a big save there. We get a face off now. I'm not sure what the call is. It's gonna be a face off in the Hilliard zone. Will Peters set to take it, wins it back to Eric Life. Life dumps it down low. Bracket will pick it up there. Once it along the near boards, far boards with Will Peters. A couple of Spirit players battling with a couple of Hilliard players in the corner as it's inching up the boards and Peters has a stick on it. He's dumped, set in front, but intercepted there by Hilliard and skated to the blue line, but they can't clear it. Held in on the right, left, left wing side, and backhander sails wide off the stick of Houston Brackett. And Hilliard will skate it back out. He a good stick there, just sent it to the boards. And intercepted there by the Spirit, now it's John Brown. Circles, falls down. And now puck picked up by Hilliard. As they'll skate in front, a shot and a score. Spirit unable to clear it. And I think they're going to call this goal off. And the Hilliard Paris are about to blow a gasket. Refer the referee it has been suspect in this game. To be fair, to be uh, to be clear, and we're going to take another look at it here. Who kicked it off? Was it us? Yeah. Yeah. So they're going to wave this goal off as the puck, the, the puck, the post was dislodged by the leg of Cale Parker. And as you can imagine, the 
Hillier parents are irate at the call. And again, the refereeing in this, in this game has been rather suspect, to be kind. But a, but a good break there for the Spirit as they dodge a bullet. And we're going to face off to the left of Parker. Hey, Tyler. So we wait to sort things out. The referee is talking it over at the Hilliard bench as we remain 1-1 one -one here with 1.14 to go in the third period. And a goal disallowed as the net had come off its post. inside the near post near post to us but just after the net had come off and waved off by the official and we will indeed have a face off and 1-1 one -one score here as Kallenberger will take the draw 1-14 to go in this third period and off the draw is puck sent to the boards and shipped up high. Now Tyler Kane will pick it up. Outlet pass finds Lovin. Center ice and into the zone. He's checked off the puck. Sent back below the net. Going around the boards. Held in by Brady Allen. Hooked up and back down low. Brady pitches but can't hold it in. Now back home. Oh, and around the defense as Boston takes a man down. The Wildcats broke it in two on one. Nice move at the blue line. Beats Bussin. Forced to take his man down. And he'll skate to the penalty box. As Bussin forced to take a man down. And now the Spirit will go to the penalty kill with just 47 seconds to go in this game. And I rate shouting from the parents here in attendance. Kill your parents. Well, Major has had three shorthanded chances in this game. Give it another. <laughs> so another face off in the spirit zone. They've got 47 seconds to kill here to try to get out of this with a tie. And it's going to be Kallenberger and Gavin Lovin to kill it for the Spirit with Life and Warner on defense. Referee throws the Hilliard player out of the faceoff dot. Now off the draw. Puck is won by Hilliard. Shot and sailing high. And Parker puts a glove on it. Freezes it once again. We'll get another faceoff. Hilliard doing a nice job in this game, winning most of the draws. I don't have a tally on that, but it seems like most of them have been going back to the point. This one goes back once again. Hilliard skates it down low. Now dumps it off into the corner. Has thought about going cross ice, decides against it. Now set in front. 
and bounces off a skate, loose puck, and picked up by Lovin. He's able to skate it to center ice, but loses it there. Careful there, almost cross-checks a man. He does cross-check a man, and man goes down, and the spirit will go down two players as he took a cross-hander, a uh, two-hander. Two as Gavin Lovin skates the penalty box, and the Spirit now down two. Just 18 seconds to go in this game. So critical last 18 seconds here. As the player's still on the ice, shaking up on that play, slowly gets to his feet and gets a good hand from the players and fans, parents. We'll skate to the bench. Faceoff will come up in the spirit zone. And a critical five on three here, late. Need one good clear here, at least, should do it. Major Carden will take this draw. Warner and Brown, and puck taken by Hilliard. Skated in front, the shot, and trickles just wide through the legs, but doesn't go. Now the net's off once again, as now Parker puts it back on. Final seconds here, five seconds to go. The shot sails wide, and that'll do it. As whistle will sound, buzzer will sound, and we'll skate off the ice with this one knotted 1-1. One, one, as it was a hard fought game all the way. Hilliard scoring first in the first period on the power play. The spirit answer in the second period, rolled by Gavin Lovin. And we skate scoreless in that third. Uh, and hold on with two men in the box late for the Spirit. They'll hang on for a one-to-one -one tie. And all things considered, uh, a productive start to this one after a rough weekend in Louisville. Uh, very nice, uh, highly competitive game this evening, and hopefully more of that uh, the remainder of this weekend, and the Spirit have a good opportunity to, to do some damage in this tournament. So we'll, we'll send it, uh, we'll, we'll sign off for now. Thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks to Kelly Carden for jumping in in the second period. Thanks to Brad Allen on the video. Thanks to Scott Lutsky for putting it all together. Once again, your final from Westfield, Indiana, Spirit 1, Hilliard 1. We'll see you tomorrow, everybody.